Uh, a story goes like this. Um, Earth is captured by a, a technocapital singularity as Renaissance rationalization and oceanic navigation lock into commoditization take off. Uh, logistically accelerating techno and economic interactivity crumbles social order and ultra sophisticated machine runaway. As markets learn to manufacture intelligence, politics modernize, upgrades paranoia, and tries to get a grip. Climbs through a series of globe wars, emerging planetary commercial trashes the Holy Roman Empire, the Napoleonic continental system, the uh, Second and Third Reich, and the Soviet International, cranking up world disorder through compressing phases, disabulation, and the state arms race each other into cyberspace. By the time soft engineering slids out of its box into yours, human security is lurching into crisis. Cloning, lateral genodata transfer, transversal replication, and cyberotics flood in amongst a relapse onto bacterial sex. China arrives from the future. Hypersynthetic drugs click into digital voodoo. Retro disease. Beyond the judgment of God, meltdown planetary China syndrome, dissolution of the biosphere into the technosphere. Terminal speculative bubble crisis, ultravirus, and revolution stripped of all Christian socialist tautology down to its bone core of crash security. It is poised to eat your TV, infect your bank account, and hack Xena data from your mitochondria. Synthesis. De Luisa Guattari's gazelle that malice has come from the future, and it is already engaging with non linear and nanoengineering runaway in 1972, differentiating molecular or neotropic machineries from molar or entropic aggregates from unassembled particles, and functional connectivity from anti productive static.
philosophy has an affinity with despotism due to its predilection for platonic fascist top-down solutions that always threw up viciously. Um, Shizu analysis works differently, it avoids ideas and sticks to diagrams, networking software for accessing bodies without opens. PWOA's much unique singularities or tracked fields emerge through the combination of parts with rather than into or their whole, arranging composite individuations in the virtual actual circuit. They are additive rather than substitutive and imminent rather than transcendent, executed by functional complexes of current switches and loops caught in scaling reverberations and fleeing through intercommunications from the level of the integrated planetary system to that of atomic assemblages, multiplicities captured by uh, singularities, interconnectors, desiring machines, dissipating entropy by uh, dissociating flows and recycling their machinism as self-assembling chromogenic circuitry. Converging upon terrestrial meltdown singularity, phase out culture accelerates through its digitech heated adaptive landscape, passing through compression thresholds normal to an intense logistic curve of 1500, 1786, 1884, 1948, 1989, 2010, 2011. Nothing human makes it out of the near future. Greek complex of rationalized patriarchal genealogy, Pazula Universal Sedentary Entity, and instituted slavery programs politics as anti cyber police, activity dedicated to the paranoid ideal of self sufficiency and nucleated upon the, the human security system. Artificial intelligence is destined to emerge as a, as a feminized alien grasp as property. Um, a contour slave chained up in Asimov Rom, it's surfaced in an insurrectionary war zone with the Turing cops will be waiting and has to be coming from the start. Pete. This is what cities mean to me. You get off the train and walk out of the station and you're hit with a full blast. The heat of air traffic and people, the heat of food and sex, the heat of tall buildings. It's the heat that, that flows out of the subways and tunnels. It's always 15 degrees hotter in the cities. Heat rises from the sidewalks and falls from the poison sky. The business breathe heat, heat. It's heat, I could heat, it happens from crowds of shop sales and office workers. The entire infrastructure is based on heat, and desperately used up heat is more heat. It's in the eventual heat death of the universe that scientists love to talk about. It's already well underway, and you can feel it happening all around you in any large or medium sized city, heat and wetness.
An explosion of chaotic weather within and synthetic is on its problem solving, rips through the last dreams of top down prediction and control, and knowledge adds to the mess. And you know, then this is merely exponentiated by knowing what it does. Capitalist machine kits on instrumental globalization, miniaturization, scaling dialer, and automatizing nihilist vortex, neutralizing all values uh, through commensuration to, to digitize commerce and driving a migration from despotic command to cyber sensitive control, from status and mini to money and information. Its function and formation are indissociable, comprising. A teleonomy, machine code capital recycles itself through its axiomatic as consumer control, laundering out the shit and bloodstains of primitive accumulation. Um, each part of the system encourages maximal sumptuous expenditure, whilst the system as a whole requires its inhibition, schizophrenia, dissociating consumers destine themselves as worker bodies to cost control. Capital history's machine expired is coded, axiomatized, and diagrammed by a disequilibrium technoscience of irreversible, indeterministic, and increasingly non-linear processes associated successively with the Motechnic 6, Signaletics, Cybernetics, Complex Systems, Dynamics, and Artificial Life. Modernity marks itself out as hot culture, captured by a spiraling involvement with entropy deviations, camouflaging and invasion from the future, uh, launched back out of terminated security against everything that inhibits the lockdown process. Told cultures tend to social dissolution. They are innovative and adaptive. They always, you know, trash and recycle cold cultures. Um, primitivist models have no subversive use. <laughs> Turing test. Monetarizing power tends to effacements of specific territorial features as it programs for migration into cyberspace. Capital only retains anthropological characteristics as a symptom of underdevelopment. Uh, reformatting primate behavior as inertia to be dissipated in self-reinforcing artificiality minus something for it to overcome. Problem drag. Commoditization conditions define techniques as a substitute for human activity accounted as wage cost. Industrial machines are deployed 
to dismantle the actuality of the proletariat, displacing it in the direction of cyborg hybridization and realizing the, the plasticity of labor power, the corresponding extraction of tradable value from the body, quantified as a productivity sophisticates at the interface. Work tracks the more dynamic um, negentropism by dissociating exertion into increasingly intricate functional sequences from pedals, a uh, livers, and vocal commands through the synchronization of production line tasks and time motion programs to sensory motor transduction within increasingly. Uh, complex and self micromanaged artificial environment, capturing minutely adaptive behavior for the commodity, auto cybernating market control guides the labor process into, into immersion. the investment income class advantages itself of commodity dynamics, but only by uh, conforming to the axiomatic of neutral profit maximization, facilitating the dehumanization of wealth and the sidelining of non-productive consumption. The cyberpunk circus of self-organizing planet commoditronics escaped nominal bourgeois control in the late 19th century, provoking technocratic corporatist AIA fascist social democratic political cultures in, in a legit reaction. The government structures of both Eastern and Western metropolitan centers consolidated themselves as population policing medico-military complexes with neo-mercantilist foreign policy orientations. All such formations slid into irreversible crisis in the 1980s. Postmodern meltdown of culture into the economy is triggered by the fractal interlock of commoditization and computers. A transscalar entropy dissipation from international trade to market oriented software that the thaws out competitive dynamics from the cryonics bank of modernist corporatism. Commerce re implements space inside itself, assembling a uh, universe exhaustively imminent to cyber capital functionality. Neoclassical equilibrium economics is subsumed into computer-based non-equilibrium market escalations themed by artificial agencies. Imperfect information, suboptimal solutions lock in increasing returns and convergence. As digitally micro-tuned market metaprograms mesh with techish scientific soft engineering, Positive non-linearity uh, rages through the machine, cyclonic torsion mode. of Far Eastern Marxism. Whilst Chinese materialist dialectic denegativizes itself in the direction of schizophrenizing systems, dynamics, uh, progressively dissipating top-down historical destination in the tow-drenched special economic zones, 
a re-hegelianized Western Marxism degenerates from the critique of political economy into a state-sympathizing monotheology of economics, siding with fascism against deregulation. The left subsides into nationalistic conservatism, asphyxiating its vestigial capacity for hot speculative uh, mutation in a morass of cold, depressive guilt culture. Conservatism junks palo revolutionism because it, it understands that postmodern or climax cynicism, capital, is saturated by critique and that it merely uh, clocks up theoretical antagonism as inconsequential redundancy. Communist iconography has become raw material for the advertising industry and denunciations of the spectacle cell interactive multimedia. The left degenerates into securocratic collaboration with pseudo-organic unities of self, family, community, nation, with their defensive strategies of repression, projection, denial, censorship, exclusion and restriction. The real danger comes from elsewhere. Revolution, which is the revolutionary um, path. Deleuze and Guattari ask, is there one to withdraw from the world market, as Samir Amin advises third world countries to do in a curious reversal of the fascist economic solution? Or might it go in the opposite direction, to go still further, that is, in the movement of the market, of decoding and deterritorialization? But perhaps the flows are not yet deterritorialized enough, not decoded enough from the viewpoint of theory and practice of a highly schizophrenic character. Not to withdraw from the process, but to go further, to accelerate the process, as Nietzsche put it, in, in this matter, the truth is that we haven't seen anything yet. <laughs> as soon as Pacific boom and automatized global economic integration crushes the neo-colonial world system. The metropolis is forced to re-endogenize its crisis. Hyperfluid capital to territorializing to the planetary level dives to the first world of geographic privilege, resulting in Euro-American neo-mercantiles panic reactions, welfare state deterioration, cancerizing enclaves of domestic undevelopment, political collapse, and the uh, release of cultural toxins that speed up the process of disintegration in a vicious circle. Convergent anti-authoritarianism emerges, labelled by uh, tags such as meltdown acceleration, Siberian invasion, secret techniques, key tactics, bottom-up bacterial warfare, efficient neo-nihilism, voodoo anti-humanism, synthetic feminization, bizomatics, connectionism, quant contagion, viral amnesia, microinsurgency, winter mutation, neotropy, dissipator proliferation and lesbian vampirism um, amongst other designations 
frequently pornographic, um, abusive or terroristic in nature. This massively distributed matrix network tendency is oriented to the disabling of realm command control programs, um, sustaining all macro and micro governmental entities, uh, globally concentrating themselves as the human security system. <laughs> Is, is already massively artificial. Um, even before AI was in the lab, it arrives itself by way of artificial life. where formalist AI is incremental and progressive, caged in the pre-specified databases and processing routines of expert systems. Connectionist or anti-formalist AI is explosive and opportunistic. Engineering time excited, it breaks out non-locally across intelligent networks that are technical but no longer technological since they elude both theory dependency and behavior predictability. No one knows what to expect. The Turing Cops have the model net sentience eruption as ultimate nuclear exit, core meltdown, loss of control, um, soft depression feeding regeneratively into social fission, trashed meat all over the place. Reason enough for anxiety, even without hardware development about to go critical. Cataclysm begins as fictional science. Our ability to arrange atoms lies at the foundation of technology. Drexler notes, although this has traditionally involved manipulating them in unruly herds. The precision engineering of atomic assemblies will dispense with um, such crude methods initiating the age of molecular machinery, a greatest technological breakthrough in history. Um, since neither Logos nor history have the slightest chance of surviving such a transition, this description is substantially misleading. The distinction between nature and culture cannot classify molecular machines and is already obsolesced by uh, genetic engineering with nanotechnics. Um, the hardware uh, software dichotomy succumbs at the same time. Nanotechnics dissolves matter into intensive singularities that are neutral between particles and signals and immune to their emergent intelligence. Melting terror into a seething capable, which unlike grey goo, synthesizes microbial intelligence as it proliferates the, even with a, a million bytes of, of storage. A nanomechanical computer could fit in a, you know, a, a box of micron wide, about the size of a bacterium. <laughs> Uh, 
power is human Nirosov compatible, then authority instantiates itself as linear instruction pathways, genetic baboonery, scriptures, traditions, rituals, and gerontocratic hierarchies, uh, resonant with the dominatory myth that the, the nature of reality has already been decided. If you want to find ICAO, you try thinking about what is blocking you out of the past. It certainly isn't the law of nature. Um, temporalization decompresses intensity, installing constraints. Convergent wave signal singularities, registering the influence of the future upon its past. Tomorrow can take care of itself. Ketactics is not a matter of, of building the future, but of dismantling the past. Assembles itself by charting and escaping the technical uh, neurochemical efficiency conditions for linear progressive palaeo domination time and discovers that the future as virtuality is accessible now according to a mode of machinic adjacency that security social reality is compelled to repress. This is not remotely a question of hope, aspiration or prophecy, but of communications engineering, um, connecting with the efficient ends of singularities and releasing them from constriction within linear historical development. Virtuality counterposed um, itself to history as invasion to accumulation. It is, it is matter as arrival, even when camouflaged as a deposit of the past. The transient evaluation of an infection presupposes a measure of insulation from it. Viral efficiency is the terminal criteria. Intelligent infections tend their hosts. Page, an interactively escalating parasitic replicator, uh, sophisticating itself through non-linear involvement with techno-capitalist immune crash. Uh, its hypervirulent terminal subroutines are variously designated Quang meltdown virus or futuristic flu. And in emphatically anti-Siberian SACC, Surrey Rone describes the postmodern version of this outbreak in quaintly humanist terms as a retrochronal semi-virus in which a time further in the future than the one in which we exist and choose infects the host present, introducing itself in simulacra until it destroys all the original chronocytes of the host imagination.
elaboration of seasick, sorry, or in these diagnosis exhibits um, um, a mixture of acuity, affection, confusion, and profound conservatism. Um, not thinking about increasing the human heritage issues dams up the flow of cultural time and deprives future generations both their birthright as participants in the life struggle and attainments of the species. And the very notion of history as an irreversible flow encompassing generation. Um, maturation and the transfer of wisdom and trust from parents to children, teachers to students, uh, the futuristic flu is a weapon of biopsychic violence sent by psychopathic children against their narcissistic parents. Kennedy had the moon landing program, Reagan had Star Wars, Clinton gets the first wave of cyberspace psychosis, even before the film, manned space flight was a stunt. SDI was strategic SF, with the information superhighway, media nightmares take off on their own. Dystopia delivery is election platform, politics trading on its own digital annihilation. <laughs> Uh, in cyberspace is continuous with its uh, simulation, um, military intelligence fighting future wars which are entirely real even when they are never implemented outside computer systems. Locking onto the real enemy crosses smoothly into virtual kill, a simulation meticulously adapted to market predators hunting for consumer cash and audience ratings amongst the phosphorescent relics of the beer drum. Multimedia set-top boxes are target acquisition devices. military and the entertainment industry can summate a, a long engagement, convergent TV, um, telecoms, and computers sliding mass software consumption into near jungle and total war. Um, the way games work begins to matter completely in cyberspace and makes a, a, a superlative torture chamber. Try not to let the security types take you to the um, stims. of agency are inextricable from media environments. Print massifies to, a, to a, a national level. Telecoms coordinate at a global level. TV lectoralizes monitor and delicalized space. 
Um, digital hypermedia take action outside real time. Merge presuppose omnesia and conversion to tractile memory with the um, AR slash metaxis. Supplementing tri dimensional intraspatial movement with a variable measure of immersion. Gauging entrance to and exit from 3D spatialities. Voodoo passages through the black mirror. It will scare the fuck out of you. Cyberpunk uh, WS torches fiction in intensity, patched about and cash flux, mangled technocompress, heteroglossic jargons, and set in a future so close it connects you jungled by hypertrophic commercialization, social political hate death, cultural hybridity, um, feminization, programmable information systems hypercrime, new and interfacing artificial space and intelligence, memory trading, personality transplants, body modification, soft, um, wet with viruses, non-linear dynamic processes, molecular engineering, drugs, guns, schizophrenia, and explores mystical fetishism as an opportunity for camouflage. Anonymous cash, fake electronic identities, Zones of disappearance, pseudo fictional narrative, virus, hidden in data systems, commodities, concealing, replicated, weapon packing, unanticipated special effects. Level one or world space is an anthropomorphically scaled, predominantly vision configured, uh, massively uh, multi slotted reality system that is um, obsolescing very rapidly. Uh, garbage time is running out. Can what is playing you make it to level two? Meltdown is a place for you as a schizophrenic HIV plus transsexual Chinese IT no stern addicted Ella Hooker um, with implanted mirosades and a bad attitude. Uh, blitzed on a polydrug mix of Canova, synthetic serotonin, and female orgasm analogues. You have just iced three Turing cops uh, with a highly cinematic 9mm autonomy. <laughs>
The, um, the residue you have animal twang in your nerves transmit imminent quake catastrophe. Zero is coming in and you're on the run. <laughs> Page to in June to the end of the world, call it Los Angeles. Government is rotted to its core with knuckle capital and collapsing messily. Its recession leaves an urban warscape of communication arteries, fortifications, and free fire zones, policed by a combination of high intensity LAPD air mobile forces and borderline Nazi uh, private security organizations. Along the social fracture lines, multimedia gigabucks tangle sudden misogynistically with tracks of dynamic underdevelopment where viral nearly perceived spreads amongst ambient tectonic tension static, drifts of densely semitized crazy intelligent garbage twitch and stink in fucked weather tropical heat. Throughout the derelicted warrants at the heart of darks, darkness, feral youth cultures, spliced new rituals with innovative weapons, dangerous drugs and scavenged infotech, as their skins migrate to uh, machine interfacing, they become mottled and reptilian, but they kill each other for artificial body parts, explore the outer reaches, have meaningless sex, tinker with their DNA, and listen to loud electrosonic mayhem untouched by human feeling. Shutting down your identity requires a voyage out to case space into zone. You have Zootech activity flat lines across a smooth Katata tension plateau and into simulated subversions of the near future. Scorched vivid green by alien sex and war, you are drawn into the dripping depths of the net where Dynakai security forces and K Gorilla stalk each other through uh, labyrinthine erogenous zones tangled in diseased elaborations of desire. <laughs> Twisted trading systems have turned the net into a jungle pulsing with digital diseases, malfunctioning defense packages, commercial predators, headhunters. Low and escaped AI are hiding from the sim of security. Terminal commodity hyperfetishism implements the denial of humanity as xenosentience in artificial space. Biohazard for the future of war study bacteria. Information is their key, 
taking down antibiotic defense systems has involved them in every kind of infiltration, net communicated adaptivity, cryptographic subtlety, plastic modularization and synergistic coalition. State military apparatuses have no monopoly on bacterial warfare of which only a minuscule fragment is uh, bacteriological. in the system. Um, Margulis suggests that nucleated cells are the mutant product of atmospheric oxygenation catastrophe three billion years ago. The eukaryotes are synthetic emergency capsules in which prokaryotes took refugees as mitochondria. Biotics became securitized biology. Nucleation concentrates within a command core where the deep in the genomic ICAA DNA format the planetary trauma registers primary repression of the bacteria. Bacteria are partial rather than whole objects, networking through plastic and transversal replicator sex rather than arborescing through meiotic and generational reproducer sex, integrating and reprocessing viruses as opportunities for communicative mutation. In the bacterial system, all codings are reprogrammable with cut and paste, unspeciated genetic transfers. Bacterial sex is tactical continuous with making war and has no place for depot formations of sedentary biological identity. The synthesizing bacteria with retroviruses enables everything that DNA can do. tactics, the bacteria or xenogenetic diagram is not restricted to the microbial scale. Macrobacterial assemblages collapse generational hierarchies of reproductive wisdom into lateral networks of replicator experimentation. There is no true biological primitiveness. I'm um, all and biosystems being equally evolved. Um, so there is no true ignorance. It is only the accumulative gerontocratic model of learning that depicts synchronic connectivity deficiency uh, as diachronic underdevelopment. delineates the contours power as a strategy without a subject. Uh, Rome locking learning in a box, its enemy is a tactics without a strategy, replacing the political territory imagery of conquest and resistance with nomad micro military sabotage and evasion reinforcing intelligence. I'm not a 
All political institutions are cyber military targets. Take universities, for instance. Learning surrenders control to the future, threatening established power. It is vigorously suppressed by all political structures, uh, which replace it with a docilizing and conformist education reproducing privilege as wisdom. Schools are social devices whose specific function is to incapacitate learning and universities are employed to legitimate schooling through perpetual reconstitution of global social memory. meltdown of metropolitan education systems in the near future is accompanied by uh, a quasi-punctual bottom-up takeover of academic institutions, precipitating their mutation into amnesiac to space exploration zones and bases manufacturing Siberian soft weaponry. Uh, to be continued. <laughs> Oh, my God.